There we go. <laughs> I didn't know if you could hear me or not. It's a Meatless Monday. Chef Johnny Prep is in the Fox 2 kitchen. Thank you for being here. Good morning. How are you? Um, so your background, uh, you worked automotive for years. I did. And I did. now in retirement, you're sort of, you switched gears. Well, I'm kind of following my passions. You know, I mean, I've, I've been cooking and cooking and cooking for years. And I've written cookbooks and I've gone to culinary school. And I've worked with kids. And I've really got a passion for working with kids and coaching and teaching. So I decided to put them together. And now we're working with schools, creating clubs where kids are trying to make it popular to eat healthy. Yeah, and it's a great idea. It's called uh, Quality Kids Program. Yep, and, Quality for uh, Kids. Yeah, one of the stories I did was creating a competition, and kids had to learn about creating recipes, mm -hmm. and marketing, and sales. I mean, it really encompassed uh, uh, so many lessons. Well, we're trying to get the kids to take ownership, you know, and, and if they create the recipes, you know, 90-some percent of the time, they're going to like those recipes, right. you know, and then if they go out and tell the other kids to try it, the likelihood of them trying it are really quite a bit better than if I ask them to try it, right. you know, so, right, exactly. and that's what we found, so we just want to kind of, we want to kind of fuel that, you know, and let these kids kind of take some energy and, and create the yeah, momentum instead of themselves. Us always telling them, don't eat those. Exactly. Let the All right, kids. so let's get to cooking today. Jim. Okay. What do we got here? Okay, we've got a, 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 a uh, uh, udon noodles with okay. a red curry paste. We've so got, got some red, red This is the red curry paste. This is red curry paste, which I've heated up in some oil to kind of get the flavors out. Now I'm going to add some coconut milk, which is, which is a very, very healthy fat. Coconut milk is a really wonderful, oh, that smells wonderful good. ingredient. Yeah, doesn't that really just wake like up the room? Yeah, how you doing? Damn, good. Good, good. Really good. Mm. We're going to be adding just a little bit of vegetable stock in here. So that kind of creates your sauce. Okay. We're just going to turn that up. And really, it's, it's just that simple. We're just going to blend these flavors together. I've got some fresh cilantro chopped up here yeah. and some fresh mint. So like the, the Thai curries mix the fresh herbs with the spice, which oh. kind of differentiates a little bit from the Indian curries and some of the cur other curries in the Middle East. So we blend, blend all that together in a nice little sauce, and then we're going to add our noodles. That's now I brought it. two kinds of noodles. I brought a traditional udon noodle, but I thought just to kind of bring up the health a little bit, I actually brought a green tea noodle here. Yeah, these are actually green, so the, the noodles are made with green tea. There's green tea in there, which you know has antioxidants in it, which yeah. is kind of healthy. And um, we're just going to add all that in there together. So you pre-cook your green tea noodles. You pre-cook the noodles, exactly, to kind of al dente, you know, and you want to cook them in there a little bit. I don't want to get too much in the pan or we're going to get are it Are those out. noodles made with green tea or are they yes. actual green tea noodles? They're actually made with green tea. I know, uh. isn't that fascinating? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, they're it really is. They're really green. Very... Yeah. So there must be a substantial amount in there, huh? Yeah. There you go. Thank you. All right. And then we're going to add some red lentils which, you know, lentils actually don't, don't turn red once you cook them, but they start out red. Oh. And you know, you got some um, you got some protein in here. You got some more additional health benefits from adding the lentils. So this overall is a pretty nice dish. It is. And then just to give it some crunch, because we like to like do this textural play. Mm -hmm. You know, so we got the noodles, and these are a little softer. We're actually going to put some peanuts. And there we go. And then we're going to toss that in with some peanuts. And really, it's just that simple. We just toss that together, let it heat up for just a minute, and we'll plate it. And then to kind of complement that, I brought with me a plate of grilled romaine lettuce. That's kind of all the rage these days in all the high-end restaurants. You just take a, a, a dish of, of, of or a, a, a heart of romaine and slice it in half lengthwise okay. and throw it on your grill no, no, until it gets some char. Any oil anything, Johnny, or no? Yeah, I brush it a little bit with a little bit of olive oil. Yeah. Okay, and then you okay. just grill it till it gets a little bit, till it gets a little bit uh, charred like that, so you get some flavor from there. Yeah. I made a, uh, a, a buttermilk Parmesan cheese dressing. Really? And, um, uh, you should be able to get that because I cut them in half, so they should come off fairly easily. Oh, yeah, okay, good. Nice. And, uh, try this and then some pomegranates, which are really, really, you know, beautiful for the season. They add color. They're in season right now. They're very inexpensive. I know, they're so pretty. Pomegranate. And you know, there's a little trick to pomegranates. What is this? You cut them in half, and huh? you take a big spoon, and you just spank them. You spank and a pomegranate, come right and the seeds right. just drop right That's out into a bowl. Idea. Thank it's you. much easier than getting your I hands in there because you know you know how the seeds that they juice kind of dyes your hands a little kitchen. bit. Yes, yeah. it looks like yeah. Spooky. Just spank a pomegranate. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he said. <laughs> I wasn't even trying to go there. <laughs> Here, why don't we just garnish guys, that up just a little bit? You, you know. All right. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. All there right, you go. Ready? My pleasure. My pleasure. All right. Give it a bite the, here. The extra garnish was a little more peanuts there? I put a little peanuts. You can put actually a little bit of uh, mm -hmm. peanuts. 
on there. You can put a little bit of extra mint and a little bit of mm. extra cilantro, I think. Nice. It kind of kicks up the flavor a little bit. And it looks good, too. Yeah, I think that mint really kind of mm -hmm. juices up the mm. flavor Look a little at bit, that. too. That's a nice plate right there. What do you think, guys? It's a nice little healthy, uh, Marty. Nice We're little healthy Marty meatless Monday. You got good your salad. Man. You got your substance. You got the whole thing going on. We're happy. You have made us very happy. Thank well, you. Well, good. <laughs> well, good. Well, thank you. We we'll put man. the recipe on myfoxdetroit.com in the cooking school section. So it's good. good. It's got a nice good. flavor to it. A yeah. A little, little bit of kick at the end. Yeah, it's good. A little bit of kick at the end. Not mm -hmm. too bad. Mm -mm. You know. And if you want to adjust that, you just put a little less Thai curry paste in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, you can you can tone it down or you can tone it up, whatever whatever you like to do. I even actually take the uh, peanuts and put a little bit of uh, uh, chili powder in the peanuts sometimes. Very nice. You know, which good stuff. Well. We're going to tone it Thank up right you. now with the music of Maya Sharp. She is standing by in Studio C. That is AG and Maya Sharp. They are in concert. We'll tell you where you can hear them. And also, we'll give you a little song. That is coming up. Ladies, there's still time to impress your family and friends with a more youthful appearance this holiday season. Hi, I'm Dee, Dee from Evolution Medical Spa. I've helped thousands of women look and feel younger using only the best non-invasive technology. And I would love to help you too. Find out how you can